phone, we've got a damn near celebrity. Good morning, Tim. Good morning, Abby. You, 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 you're Tim Hamilton. You've been my buddy for a little while. But now, mm. now the whole world kind of knows, yeah? Because you created a, a really great hoax video. Yeah. What? Yeah, that's accurate. Right? It is, eh? I'm, I'm bang on the money there. So, Actually, did you know, I've known you for more than a little while. My mum let me know that I went to your... Or no, you went to my first birthday party. You know, that's funny you say that, because my mum told me that, too, just a couple of days ago. And look at us go. A long, <laughs> a long, a long friendship. Um, so, you made this big eel hoax video. Mm-hmm. Can you tell us a bit what was your, what was your planning behind that? To be honest, it was like... You know that clip that you did the music for? Yes. Um, it was, took us three months to do. We were like, because we were doing that and getting really tired and we we're working like 15 hour days for months at a time. Yeah. And um, it was like one of those four in the morning brain farts that were just like, let's, um, let's just do this. And then we just did it. Yeah. Yeah. Just like that. And yeah. Did... Well, the, sorry. No, you, you go. go. No, you go. Okay, well, the, well the, the video that we're working on at, at the time, anyway, you just used all the same techniques. It's just keen tracking and roto, and um, we got really fast at it, so we just, yeah, it only took a few hours to, to like, the eels are, like, happy as, they're, they're down in my, in my parents' stream, so they just, like, jumped in the bucket. We just said, look, we'll give you some luncheon, and they're like, <laughs> sweet, I'll jump in your bucket, and then we took the bucket up to the house, and, like, you know what, I'll just jump in that bath for you. They, we didn't even line the bath with, with red material or, or any green screen stuff. The, the eels all did it for us. They were just happy. Yeah. yeah. So it was really, it's all down to the eels, really. Yeah, man. I, I, can't, I can't do a thing, you know. I just, um, I'm just the face for it. <laughs> that's, that's beautiful, Tim. That's really beautiful. Um, so it's, it's blowing up. Did you expect it to go so big? Um, I don't know. How, how big is it? Um, I don't know what your view count is at the minute, but, like, it's... I googled the... I mean, like, YouTube searched the video this morning, and there's lots mm. of different versions of the video that, like, other YouTube channels have put up. Oh, that's right. I suppose that's kind of a sign of success, but it's also just really annoying. Yeah. Like, but, um, doesn't bother me that much. I'm not... I didn't actually know how to do the whole monetization thing. You know how you make money off YouTube. Yeah, I yeah. Don't know how to do that? <laughs> yeah, you you missed you missed uh, missed a good opportunity on that one. But uh, it might not it might not be too late. You know. Yeah, I figured it out last night, but that was at the same time that all these other people put up videos, so there's almost no point. I'm pretty sure now you've got to make the title the original monster eel yells at pizza bread. Right. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's how it goes. Hey, and also, what what made you decide to use pizza bread? Well, because we feed we fed the eels luncheon because eels really like luncheon. It's like it's a commodity for them, you know. <laughs> uh, and when you think about luncheon, it looks exactly like little bits of pizza bread. Oh, yeah. So, if you have a look at the clip, um, the one with Josh feeding um, the eel pizza bread, yeah. The, and, in the water, it's luncheon, and his hand is pizza bread. Oh! So, you know, they're, they're just scaled up. Um, they're the same sort of colour and, and, and uh, density. You're so clever. It blows my mind. Oh, I, I'm not clever. It was with the eels. Yeah. And I'm still renting. I, I owe them so much for renting those cameras. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I bet. The eels charge a hefty fee. Yeah. Look at you go. Well, I'm really proud of you. So, so this is promoting your business, the shiz. Well, we're using it now <laughs> that, yeah. that it's doing well to promote the business, yeah. So, tell us a bit about the shiz. The shiz. The shiz is just um, well, me and uh, my partner, Katie, who you've met. Yep. Uh, we uh, just finished studying uh, business management together. Yeah. And... Basically, the shiz is just a way to um, make um, advertising and, and, and the job that we do uh, legally tight. That's all. Yeah. Um, you know, it's just a legal entity name. But, you know, why have a boring name like Tim Hamilton Videos or Tim and Katie Videos and Photography? That's the one. Sort of the shiz. 
I love it. I love it. It's it's crafty. So if people wanted, if people were like, oh my gosh, I need my business to get to get a, a viral video like this, you what what? How do they get in touch with you? Oh, they they need to get in touch with the eels really. Um, oh, they yeah. can do that with three fast taps on their nearest stream, and and <laughs> and there should be some arriving <laughs> soon. <laughs> Well, honestly, um, viral videos aren't something that you can just manufacture. Yeah. Um, been a- businesses have been asking me to do it for years, and I can't do it. Yeah. You know, like, you know that last one that we worked on, it's like one and a half thousand views. It took three months of work. Yeah. You know, it's gotten barely any attention, but also people shouldn't really be interested necessarily in, in viral videos, but videos that get um, a lot of engagement and yeah. a lot of people, you know, uh, interacting and talking and you know, why show someone something if they're not going to do anything with it? Yeah. Yeah. So, where we can help if, if there's anyone out there that wants the shiz to make something for them, um, is actually making a video of quality, not necessarily a viral one. Yeah, yeah. You know, or, or we can shoot them nude. We shoot a lot of nudes at the moment. That's, yeah. that's what I really enjoy. You shot my nudes. I really appreciated that. <laughs> yeah. You know I shot Adam's as well, eh? Oh, true. <laughs> Look at that. So for all your uh, nude needs, hit up the shiz. They'll cov- they'll they'll get you covered, but not yeah. so covered. Yeah, well, I'm I'm still waiting on Benny to get back. Yeah, <laughs> I'm sure and the Benny to Penny nudes will be coming your way any minute. Yeah. Sweet. Thanks, Abby. <laughs> not a problem. Thank you so much for talking to us, Tim. I know you're a you're a highly highly sought after man these days. Oh, not really. You can still just come visit. <laughs> oh, thanks. You still, you still need to visit and, and have a look over those videos if, if you want. Yeah, I really do need to. I will. Yeah. I will do that. All right. Well, love you. <laughs> love you, you too. You have a good time on radio. I will, I will. You have a good time. Uh, you've just been at the recycling centre. Oh, you're, yeah. s- you're such, a, you're such a, a kind man to the environment. Yeah. Should I offer out, like, a prize? for anyone who can come to the recycling centre in the next 50 seconds and say radio control. Yeah, yeah. They, they can have um, uh, Gemma's Donnie Darko DVD. Sweet, sweet. It's all yours if you get to the recycling centre in 50 seconds. Good luck, good luck. Awesome, thank you so much, Tim. You're welcome, Abby, anytime. Love you, bye. Bye.